Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to start my speech with the story of a little boy. A boy who cannot catch up with friends at school. A boy who needed to quit school since he was young because the teacher thought that he was not interested in the lesson. A boy who had problems about hearing since he was a student. Ladies and gentlemen, many people may thought that this boy will fail and will never succeed in his life. But who knows, the boy has problems from learning at school and the problems with his ear to become one of the world's most well-known scientists. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking about Mr. Thomas Edison, one of the world's greatest scientists the one who invents many inventions and innovations to the world like the light bulb system or even the video camera. Ladies and gentlemen, the reason why I choose him as my inspiration person is because he never gave up and he showed to the world that even he are not good or have anything as good as others, he can also succeed. Even he failed a lot of time at some point, he succeeds and he showed to the world that he can do it. Ladies and gentlemen, I always believe that actions speak louder than words. Mr. Thomas Edison once said that the road to success is only 1% about inspiration, but another 99% is about taking the real action on it. In your real life, there are many things that may distract you from to the point of success. The first enemy is yourself. Yourself is the one who commands your life. If you fail and yourself say that you don't want to continue anymore, you will never continue to do it. The second enemy is your friends. Your friends is the people who are who comes around you and tell you what is good and what is bad, even if it's true or not. But there was effect to your actions and your feelings. The third enemy is your family. Some families have expected their children very high. That sometimes that they cannot do as what they expected, they feel disappointed and tell them their children are failure. Ladies and gentlemen, the most important things and the hardest thing in your life is to get across or get over the enemies of your life. You need to be strong and get over those fear. Like yourself, your friends, your family. You need to tell the world that you can do it even you fail millions of times. Like what Thomas Edison done. He quit school not because he is not good at learning but because he don't like the style or the way that the teacher or the school teach him. He wants to learn by himself with his mother and become successful by doing his experiment and getting knowledge by himself, not by people teaching him. He may be different, but he showed to the world that he can do it by his own way. Ladies and gentlemen, Rome was built in one day. If you want to be a doctor, it may take more than five to six years to make you success and become a doctor in a hospital. In the same way of life, if you want to become success, it also takes a lot of time for you to prove and change. The most important thing is that you need to change your mind. Because many of you might think that you are not good as others. But who knows, like Thomas Edison, he doesn't like the way the teacher teaches in school. He also has a problem with his ear. But he can also succeed. So why don't you try to change your mind and never give up like him? Thank you.